You know, in this film, Spy Kids, you get to play, a, you've played a dad in Entourage, you get to play a villain in Spy Kids. What have you learned from working with the tween set? Um, you learn so much working with kids because they haven't even, they have no reference for, for they only have a reference for being truthful in front of the camera. So, and they're uninhibited, and that's, that's basically what you should be as an actor at all times. That's why when you meet someone who's, you know, a grown person, they're very kind of childlike and tragic, like myself, <laughs> because you always have to be in a state of play, and that's, that's the key to it. Keeps you really present, I imagine. I, I hope so. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Like, it's, it was very cute, because Rowan, who was the lead in this, and it's the cutest thing in the world, and an amazing little actress, I mean, to be that tiny and to understand like sarcasm and all, I'm like going, what is she? She's like a 40 year old woman in a 10 year old body. <laughs> she is a machine. She's genius. And we, the first thing I said to her is, you look like you could be my daughter. And she's like, you look like you could be my dad. And her dad's a yoga teacher and, and he's been my yoga teacher since, since we met on this movie and, and we hang out all the time together. Great synergy, I yes. like it. Yeah. Now you get to play multiple versions of your character in this yes. film. I mean, if, if you could do this in real life, what would both of you be doing right now? Um, I would be outside. Um, I would probably be stand up paddling uh, in Mal Malibu. Um, I would not be here with you right now. Not that I don't love it. I won't take it personally. <laughs> yes, there, there are there are multiple. And, uh, there's one of me that's in Saint Tropez right now. There's one of me that's still asleep. Yeah, <laughs> that's not a bad thing. <laughs> and I always, it, you know, made me think like, what would Ari Gold? What time period would he travel back to? Because we did a lot of time travel in Spy Kids. Um, Ari Gold would not would travel to any time other than the Great Depression. You know what I mean? He needs some money. He needs the U.S. currency. Yeah. And I couldn't be more different than the lovable Ari Gold. That's a good Yeah, name. and I think I'll probably, you know, I, you can talk until you're blue in the face about that, but I think that I'm just going to let, you know, things like this speak for themselves because I couldn't have I couldn't have written it better. It's like to make a transition from Entourage into this beautiful children's movie in which I'm playing all these different characters that are so unbelievably different than Ari is just, it's a gift. It's a nice juxtaposition. Yes, I'd say. Yes. Wow, I'm an actor. Who knew? Who knew that? <laughs>